Capricorn, welcome to your coffee cup reading for this week. This is an amazing, magical week. It is the fairy week. Have you listened to the video I did yesterday about the magical fairies where you pick a fairy? I gave you five. You pick one. You dress it up the way you want. You put colors. You put magic into it. You make it look you get your magic out and you put wings and you create the wings the way you want and you travel with me into the coffee cup where you find your magic into the cup. It's a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful video. And for this week and what we go going through, I really say, find your magic, find your magic. Okay, so the bottom of the cup is a bit, it's a bit wet. I don't know if you cried, if you've been stressed, if you, it's really interesting. There is lots of tears in the bottom of the cup, but I'm gonna leave the tears for now. <laughs> um, and it is so funny. Your hard work is paying off. It's a new moon in Capricorn. Can you believe it? I'm doing the coffee cup for Capricorn and I get this card in Capricorn. This is really amazing. You know, you standing up and uh, you have a cross in front of you. You've been burdened lately. You've been burdened. There is a lot, but the tears shifted something. And, and, and it's like you're standing looking at the situation. You've been burdened, but at the same time, you have your hands up in the air. It's like, thank God. And it's like you're learning so much. You're not going to learn to let the burdens bring you down. You are strong and you are tenacious and you are going to keep going. It doesn't matter till you get to where you want to get. And I love it because... You standing up there in balance, moving on. Even there are tears, even there are situations that you don't like, you moving on and, 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 and balance. And, and, and then all of a sudden, I see you in here like the roomy, you know, like the roomy dancing. And I, I could never see, it's so funny because I will never see the roomy in anyone else as much as in you. Uh, in some ways, but dancing. So I think the coffee cup is telling you it's time for magic. It's time to just let go of all this stuff and just play. Let's have a dancing time together. Let's put the music and let's dance and get that fire moving with us. You tired in here, you drained. So look at you, you laying back. And the goat behind you is saying, dance, let's dance, let's dance. I am tired too of pushing with you. It's time to let go and enjoy the magic of life. Life is so magical, let's dance. And, and, and here you manage to get out of, you manage to look at things differently, but you're standing up deep inside, you are cool, you are clear, you know what you want, you know, deep in your heart, you're very deep and very spiritual. The thing is, you have a big, um, you have something on your mind that weighing you down, something hurting you. And here, a window open up, one dot, maybe one week, maybe one month. But you want to push out, but you can't. Right now you can't. There is something on your head, something heavy, something dark, something overwhelming, something chaotic. I don't know what it is, a situation. But then in a dot from now, maybe a week, maybe a month, look at the heart, look at the heart. A window is gonna open up a window of heart that really, take you out into a different dimension. Let's see what the cards say, because sometimes the card express it more, you know, it, it kind of hone on, on uh, what we need to hone on, you know. Um, a new moon. And... 
Capricorn. Your hard work is paying off. First and foremost, this card suggests a new start for you professionally. Whatever has been going on in your work and life, this card heralds the start of a new and improved work cycle. If you are unhappy in your current job, this is the time to either renegotiate your position or look for something new. Whatever your question, whether work-related or otherwise, a new plan and a strategy is called for. You need to take a look at the long term and think about where you want to be in 12 months or five years. This will inform your best course of action now. So think seriously about it. Attune to the moon for this weekend because we have a new moon and a full moon energy. Make a proper plan and execute it well. Take care, you guys. I hope you go and you listen to that video, the, the uh, magical fairies. Please. Get yourself dancing, get yourself up in a beat position. Don't uh, think of failure. Don't think of uh, hard time and, and overwhelmed uh, work and overwhelmed emotions. Things are coming up together. You need to be ready. So get ready to your magic so you can make it happen. Please like and subscribe. I really appreciate you.